Hey guys, HMK once again, and we are not safe. On top of all the Switch hype and the Zelda hype and the Bing Bang Bibbidi Bop, oh my goodness, we got another screenshot from Breath of the Wild, courtesy of Nintendo on their Legend of Zelda Facebook page. Here we see Link paragliding towards what looks like it could be a hollowed out tree trunk, it could be uh, a mountain region that was blown off by something and then hollowed out because you know a lot of people say it might be a tree trunk with like some moss and I see some grass growing on top of it uh, if it was some sort of a uh, mountain or anything like that it kind of does match the surrounding area a bit in terms of color but I mean I think it might have been uh, a tree trunk it could have been a mountain and I'll explain why in a second and we see him gliding down towards this region and the beautiful water glistening with the sunset in the corner and the big different mountainous regions with the grass and the trees it all oh, looks so good and if you look up into the right hand corner you do see a bit of a red mountainous region um which is basically like, you know, the, the desert or the barren wasteland looking place that we've seen on the map. Uh, a lot of people say this might be leading over to Death Mountain. Uh, I could I could see that happening because, I mean, that it, like it, the mountains go from gray to red. And when that happens, you know, we got some heat going on up in the business. But um, what I like to say about this little, this bit, little, pff, yeah, okay. There's a big hollowed out thing. Uh, it could be a tree that toppled over and then the trunk got hauled out by God knows what but maybe just maybe this area is close enough in the vicinity or uh, not even close enough in the vicinity because we don't know the power of Calamity Gang. It could have been uh, to the point of the vicinity where uh, we saw in the Life of the Ruins trailer where uh, Calamity Gang was getting sealed up. I want to assume that he was getting sealed up in uh, the Hyrule Castle when a bunch of um, fireballs just spewing away from the castle. And this little thing kind of looks like a crater that could have been created by uh, one of those big ass fireballs that got shot out from the castle. But at the same time, it might not be because um, in the aftermath uh, in that trailer after that uh, fireball, I want to assume that we see those weird black and pink puddles of darkness or dankness or disgustingness uh, left over from that. They were the same color as the fireball, so I want to say that those are left over from that. And here we don't see that. So it could be just like a, a, a giant tree trunk that fell over and got hollowed out in the time of, you know, nature reclaimed the land or whatnot. But, you know, a part of me just thinks this is stone uh, along with um, the colors of the surrounding area. So it could be a little stone tunnel hollowed out by God knows what. Uh, a, a piece of mountain that just fell over and got blasted by one of those Gandorf, not Gandorf, but Calamity Gan blasts. But we don't really know, and I can't really zoom in much on this because the resolution, uh, the resolution will fail us when that happens. But I re I'm really digging this water area that's uh, over on the left side. It really looks nice. I'm really excited for the water effects or whatnot. And man, this game has to come out at the Switch launch. I am ready. I know you guys are ready. Uh, from everything else that we see here, we see a bunch of trees growing on the various mountain region. And like Nintendo said, if we can see it, we can get there in Breath of the Wild. Uh, I, I just wonder what the borders are going to be like in this game. If there really is no borders or just like maybe the, the game is the entire world and <laughs> it repeats uh, just like, you know, world games like Dragon Ball Z, Budokai 3 or whatever. But I'm down to see what else we have in store. And this looks grand. It's a grand landscape. Uh, I want to know what you guys think about this awesome new image. If I missed anything, leave it in the comment section below. But until tomorrow, which is the big Switch event, I'm pretty sure they're going to showcase Breath of the Wild a lot during that event. Don't forget to like, share, favorite, and most importantly, subscribe to HMK for more Zelda and Nintendo news. I've been HMK, and I'll check you guys later.